and the effort to save this mural in Moorhead. Good evening, everyone. A Moorhead Park that has repeatedly fallen into the hands of the flooding Red River may soon be home to a growing sport. But an eight-year-old mural painted on a water-damaged building in the tennis park has many in the Hispanic community calling on the city to save the artwork. The story from WJY 6 reporter Kevin Wallivant. I don't really think the building is in bad shape. I to Monica Trevino, this is more than just a mural. Um, representing strength. The mural project in Moorhead's Riverfront Park is part of this area's Latino Rivers culture, featuring the role of elders, women, youth, and men. I believe if you learn about other people's cultures, it brings down barriers, and that's what I think it represents. Eight years ago, 52 students painted this mural, a way to get rid of graffiti at the park. Yeah, but this is the youth side, representing our future. But now the building, which acts as its canvas, is in disrepair, flood damaged. Now this place is left untouched. And the city wants it down. It needs a lot of work not just from flood, just from age too. So. While tennis has met its match on this property, an ever-growing sport in Fargo-Moorhead may actually find a new home here, disc golf. There's nothing like it. There's nothing like this mural project in the Fargo-Moorhead area. It's so bright and colorful and pretty. The Latino community wants the murals to be somehow preserved, but the city and FEMA have said they don't have the money to repair the old building. Kevin Wallowan, WDAY 6 News. Because the land has been shifting in the park because of flooding, the tennis courts have been unusable for the last five years. 